high. Playing this again. And with me is... He's not going to say it, is he? <laughs> Maybe. It's Scowl me. Order. Yes. Alright. Y'all's going to give me motivational support thingamajig. My efforts to beat the Special Cup, which I have tried to beat several times now. Wait, you're doing the 50cc too? Yeah, I was going to do 50cc and 150cc. But I, I might thought just, you were a... Oh, wow. I might just skip over doing 150cc if I suck too bad at it. Yeah, maybe you should quit after you finish this. This seems hard enough. Okay. So, Angel, what's the problem? Everything. I this game so much. Alright, so this stage there's this really dick ass thing in it where, um, <laughs> okay, there's these turns and they're really sharp turns and if you don't make this turn just right, there are these like launchers and they'll set you back in the course and it is so frustrating when that happens. Also the steering in this game is like non-existent. I like how the concept of this game was make everything as flat as possible. Yeah. I don't know, it's incredible. It really is. At least the item boxes aren't flat, but the coins are. Also, it seems like lately Bowser's been replacing Luigi as the tough NPC. Yeah. It makes more sense though, because he's like actually rivalry evil, not just, hey, I'm racing with my buddies, let me be first. I can't even, I don't even know what coins do other than kind of work his HP in this game. I don't know if they actually make you faster. Well, you can get more than 10, which is already confusing. What even just happened? I might have to just already give this up. I'm just going to give this <laughs> up. I'm going to keep recording just because of that fuck. But what the hell was that? I don't know. He suddenly just fell. This game is horrible. This game is 10 out of 10. Would never make a game like this again. How did they just not look at this though and think, this isn't working right? This <laughs> shouldn't be a thing. You know, that's because all the games are tested with Asians and they can do this. They yeah, have the natural right. skill. But this is just so bad. Also, I love how the AI is so much randomly faster than me. And yeah. It's one of those cases, okay, I normally hate the AI in racing games because they don't have to deal with any of the struggles you do, but this game it's worse because they don't have to deal with the unbearably bad steering. <laughs> Aren't you one of the fastest characters as well? Peach and Toad? Yeah. I don't get this game. It's so dumb. Also, I hate the speed boost in this game. See, that's why normal Mario Kart games, you can steer when you use a speed boost. This game, you can't. You cannot steer for anything. God, why do I keep getting the mushroom? I cannot steer with it. Try I using it on straight bar. There's parts. no straight parts, hardly. Yeah, I was just gonna... Yeah. I regret oh saying that now. I almost oh? fell off the... I almost jumped off... What? What? That shouldn't even be able to happen! In a normal Mario Kart game, if that was going to happen, you just bump against an invisible wall and fall into place. Yeah, but you see, that was too much work for this game. And what is with the slowdown you get when in other parts of the course that you're not supposed to drive on? They're everywhere! Ah, uh, you, you do have that in every Mario Kart game, Yeah, though. I know, but you slow down so much more in this one. Yeah, true. Now you have a decent item. The red shell is like the only item I can depend on for anything. Yep. Can I beat Luigi? Probably not. Da See? The AI is so much faster than me for no reason a lot of the time, even though I'm supposed to be tied for fastest character in the game. And I don't know their stats, but why are Donkey Kong and Luigi like always the two most brutal NPCs? Maybe they are also fast? I don't uh, know. First, first. Yes, I have to get first the first three races to make up for my utter failures at Rainbow Road. Oh, Rainbow Road, why? But in this game, it seems like every course is just Rainbow Road. Basically. 
Also, I'm drinking water. How professional. Super professional. Is this... No, this isn't the version that's in the Wii, right? The, no. Or is it? That's a different stage? That's like a Boo Mansion, right? Ghost Valley. Ghost Valley, yeah. Exactly. It looks like it. <laughs> because it's flat and dark. Oh, man. <laughs> so bad. I think the things in the background make this stage look like a stage from a Sonic game called Pumpkin Hill Zone. Or whatever. Oh, yeah. From Sonic Adventure 2. Hey, hey, look, this is now actually recorded at a good time because it's spooky October. Yeah, spooky. This is a Halloween episode. I'm just not going to use this, probably. This okay. is the early Halloween episode. Everybody was waiting for. I'm surprised I didn't but fall off there at any point. I was just kind of steering around like a jackass. Yeah, you have to have faith, Aishel. You can do this. I really Today don't is myself. the day you will finish this. That order will bring me good luck. Or not. You will have to see. You're doing alright now, you have quite a lead. As okay, I say, I changing the whole things. thing. Okay, I got rid of the speed boost. Now I can get some useful items like the green shell. Is there a way to actually get rid of items in Mario Kart? No. I feel like that should be in this game. <laughs> Just because it's so bad. This is the most like un... I have I ran out of things to talk about in these stages. I've recorded these so many times. You know what would be cool? If you could like place a mushroom so that somebody else would run into it and they like flew off the stage? That'd actually be cool. That would work in this game. Yep. And then the AI would be like, no. Alright, I've got first two times in a round. If I can get it first on the next course, I should be set for Rainbow Road. Oh man. This is it. No pressure though. If you don't make it, you will just have to record it all over again. At a later date. Special Cup Bowser's Castle 4. There are four versions of Bowser's Castle in this stage. Is that a nuclear reactor in the background? It looks like a face. Two eyes and a stash. Yeah. Look at that. That can just be coincidence. This is so bullshit right I'll here. I wanted to make a remark at how it looks like the one in the what Wii, the but... Hell? What? I couldn't fucking get going again because everything hit me. Nah. Oh yeah, it's because I don't have any coins. Coins don't make for good HP. Okay, this is probably where I should just start doing what John said and use save states. Yeah, you should. There's justice in that. People will understand. Game is so unfair. Yeah, if you can do save states, you should this probably do that. This is like Kaizo Mario Kart, except it was an officially released game. See, I try. Okay, I'm living by my normal Mario Kart. In normal Mario Kart, you can land on the ledge of something and still keep driving and then jump off. This game, you can't. But it's so flat, it tricks you even more. And what the hell is this shit? Okay, this is where I get angry. Welcome to the Angry April show. Where you get bad reviews of so bad games. Dumb. This isn't even the hardest difficulty. But look how far the first one is in, le in the lead. That's it's, not legit. It's that dipshit Luigi. <laughs> Why, Luigi? I'll miss you. Luigi and Donkey Kong have been the bane of my existence through this whole Let's Play. Okay, I think yeah. I can still get a decent place. There is still hope. You could always save state off of this, if this is still reasonable. I don't even know how to save state in Visual Boy Advance. File, save state, save. What the hell? What was I even spinning out for? I literally just kept spinning out for no reason. That made no sense. I was just spinning. Oh, did you get a mushroom? Yes. Oh, man. Bowser, how could you do this to me? I needed that item. Okay, I think I can get first, though. Okay, you know what? Uh, where's the stupid pause button? I'm going to save right now, and I wish I could have saved before falling into the lava. Save. And uh, can see, watch no, this. wait. Yeah, save. 
I don't know if that's the way you safe stated before. I can't remember. All I know is fuck this game. I guess it would work. God, okay. The steering in this game is so impossible. Nothing is defined. This is the part where I just get so mad at this game and remember why I hate it so much. <laughs> what this the will hell? be the best See, finale any Mario ever. Kart game, you can actually steer around that. This, you can't. How is this the last this cup you have never done before? What? Is this the last cup that you have to do? Yeah. Okay. Good. What the fuck do I keep spinning out on? I just spin out at random moments for no reason. Oh look, I'm out of coins. Okay, I'm gonna load the stupid save state. I have to get first. This is gonna become so cheaty, but I don't even care. This game, they should have made a game that wasn't a piece of shit! Exactly, I shall tell them. Nintendo, how could you fucking release this game 10 years ago? I'm going to demand that you take this game off the market right now. I'm just loading it again. <laughs> right now, for all those I'm four copies. using the hotkey instead of loading it manually. I wish I could have safe stayed before falling into the lava, though. Yeah, that might have been... Useful. Full, yeah. Oh well. Oh, come on! You cannot steer! You cannot see a turn coming at the right angle, because of the way that it's so flat. See, it looks like I'm just right at that turn, but I'm not. I'm actually a bit too early to be turning, but it doesn't look that way. This game wasn't well designed. The tracks need to have some type of different thing to them. I mean, I don't know, ledges or something like that? Something that prevents you from... What is it go that you? hard to make their actual distinguished ledges? Like, I know the... Control L. Would it have been that hard, though? Just something that makes the ledge more obvious. I mean, you can do it with the cubes. Was the Game Boy Advance really that limited? If it was, you should have just realized this game shouldn't be made. If the Game Boy Advance couldn't handle ledges. Yeah, you make a decent point. Sometimes some genres or games shouldn't be on a certain handheld or console, respectively. I mean, if you look at the 3DS now, it can run decent games like Green of Time with no effort. They should have made a more. Oh wait, they did. Never mind. But this game is just no. The DS game is okay, but this one. I like no. Mario Kart DS. Mario Kart DS is limited, but they real. I think they real. In that game, they realized that what they. Were okay, I'm just gonna try to get first place right now. I don't think I can get first place. I just can't get good items or anything. Do you need first place at Rainbow Road? Pretty much, because the point distribution in this game is ungodly. Hmm. Well, it's awful. But Rainbow Road is so impossible. Want to use a safe state here or not? Yes. Save. This is the day I should broke. This game broke me. I started cheating. It's not cheating, it's called making use of your resources. Yeah, but those resources aren't normally in the game. Yeah, but I don't think resources is a definition of okay, cheating. Okay, so this is where I hate this game. These turns are absolutely impossible. And why do I take so long to get going? I, I like how that's the only thing they have to do for Rainbow Road in this version. Make a lot of turns. Also, if you guess that the AI has very little issue on these turns, then you guessed right. <sighs> that must be some kind of trick we're not getting here. I'm just going to go ahead and load again. I need to get keep in a good place close to the start. This is so yeah. unbelievable. Just yeah, ow. considering in the first few episodes it was all going okay. This isn't hard for the right reasons. This is game mechanic hard, not difficulty hard. Like, I have to st pretty much stop accelerating to get by these turns most of the time. Like, drifting doesn't work. And look at Donkey Kong. Do you notice how he has absolutely no issue with these turns that anyone would have? Yeah, of course, but he trains here all the time, you know, a jungle, a jungle, an ape. 
from the jungle. Totally ready for the rainbows. The only cool thing about this stage is Bowser's castle in the background from Paper Mario. The literal only cool thing. Yeah, I was actually gonna make note of that. That's pretty cool. There's also rainbow what? stars. It's so <laughs> impossible not to drive off the edge. And has Donkey driven off the edge once? Like anyone w who has not devoted their life to being good at this game would have done by now. I now I feel more pressured. I have to start doing good. I have to drive fast. I can't slow down at every single turn. They should have just... I just wish I could go back in time and just be working at Nintendo and go, you know what, we're canceling this game. I don't even give a shit if it's wasted money. This game is awful. And then you never know when some CEO. poor 16-year-old boy will see this and decide that he needs to share it with the internet and make a Let's Play of it. How, does it, how did this happen? Is it all because of... Oh. Save state load. I think it's because of greed, probably. Because Mario Kart's a popular series. So it's like, oh, popular series. We can cash this. Up. We'll make more money off this. Yeah. And why did you start Let's Playing this game again? Because we started making the Mario Kart course on YoCraft, and we needed a stage, and John started doing a thing. I mean, John played through the game to pick a stage, and then I wanted to play through the game. And all the regrets have been made today. Just gonna keep loading these stupid safe states. I wish there was just a way I could just literally turn off the ability to get a mushroom. Yeah. I you know, one thing I have to say about this game is that they were very creative with Rainbow Road this time. Yeah. I mean, going with rainbow colors is really special. <laughs> yeah, they really put a lot of thought into this rainbow road. If there is one thing that I have to blame Mario Kart, it's the originality with the final level. They should try something different. I don't know what exactly, but I don't know. Every Mario Kart game is basically the same. It's all Rainbow Road at the end. Nah, yeah, people get mad if they didn't do Rainbow Road at the end. Like, what the fuck, this game's terrible, how dare they change the formula. Yeah, of course, but I don't know, maybe like bonus level would fix that. Maybe something darker or something. Also, is it normal that there are clouds so high up in the sky? No. I knew you would know that. I mean, you can see the earth down below us. Yeah. Just barely can see it. No, you don't, can't even see the earth. You can see the inner atmosphere. Yeah, is it a light blue part, right? Yeah. Exactly. There's not enough gas up this high for a cloud to form. Well, aren't you guys creating gas? In America? Well, yeah. But gas doesn't keep at this altitude. It just kind of goes off into space. Hmm, true that. Or the atmosphere itself becomes denser. Look at the benefits I get for speed boost in this stage. This is just going to be nothing but me loading the same save state over and over. I think I should just probably end this episode off and just have the next episode be solely about me trying Rainbow Road. If I oh, have man. to load one but more save state, I wouldn't it do up that. It looks like you're doing this in one go. You should like speed it up with like a catchy tune. That always works. Yeah. I guess I will just speed through me playing through the Rainbow Road bits. But then the incredible conversations lost. Yeah. About how original the Rainbow Road is. 10 out of 10. Why do you start so slow? Is it because they didn't want you to do what's instinct and that is hold down the acceleration button when you died or whatever it is? You only have two buttons, right? Uh, I mean, two stats. Speed and acceleration? Yeah. Huh. That's odd. This game shouldn't have any, this map shouldn't have any speed boost, because most of the time I find myself, I can't drive fast. I can't. That's just, that is the actual problem with the stage. You cannot drive fast, because I have to be, I can't rely on bumming. See, and the, the stage also has a sick trick with it, all of its ledges. They look like, some of the, I find it funny, some of the most defined ledges, because they're just this weird puke green color along the rainbow color, makes it some of the most distinguished edges in this entire game. They're lies. If you take those edges, you will die. 
See, why are there speed boosts? There shouldn't be any speed boosts. This video might get randomly cut at some point. I'm not going to bother doing an outro and an intro. I'll just, if it, I feel like it's too long. Well, the main reason to be too long is because of my stupid internet that makes uploading take years to do. Well, like I said, we can speed this part up. Yeah. That makes it shorter. Um, so yeah. Rainbow Road, huh? Oh god, lag. Is game, is like Fraps or something crashing? No. I you have 4 FPS right there. Yeah, I don't know what was causing that. That was a lag I probably spike. just recorded for too long. Huh, that happens. Oh boy, I'll use the speed boost item. But I have that with other Rainbow Roads <gasps> too, where the speed boosts always screw you over. Cough, double dash, cough. <laughs> yeah, that one. Ah, I like that one though. Yeah, it, it, isn't like that the, the one with like what? Yeah, you know what was the highlight? Of, you know what's the highlight of playing double dash for me? Playing time trials. I get to enjoy the creative stage design without all the bullshit. Yeah, true that. I used to race my dad on those. Like he would go first, and I would try to beat him. See, speed boosts are shouldn't be in this stage. Who thought that? Did they really think that there are going to be anyone? There's is there anyone good enough at this game not to die at every speed boost? They Isn't there a speed run of this game? <laughs> I don't know how exactly you'd speed run a racing game other than just know the efficient way through the courses. Oh, there is one for F Zero. Well, you can like hop skip around and fly up the stage and enter at this other different point. That game is crazy. You should look up the let's play of that. Let's play a speed run of that. That's amazing. I will, I will be the one to speed run Super Circuit. <laughs> I'll get a medal for my efforts. You, you train so hard on this Rainbow Road that instead of doing it the normal way, you speed run through it. I remember there's this one puzzle in Twilight Princess that I never could figure out when I was younger, so I found a glitch instead. Like, not even looked it up, I literally found a glitch to get by it. Oh, what kind of glitch? In the Temple of Time, there's this, like, scale thing, and I can never figure out how to get it to balance correctly, so that Link could just walk across it or whatever he was supposed to do. So instead, I discovered that if you could get it to balance, I could get it to balance, but not when Link got off it, I mean, got on it, the scale would tip. This was time to tip the scales anyway. I get it to balance, and then I discovered if you get Link on his top, his top spinner thing, and then skip along on it, the scale won't tip very, will tip so slightly each time you hit the ground that you'll be able to get across it. Oh yeah, man, those puzzles. I like how those were, those were puzzles like based around the concept of Wind Waker, with the song. I don't know what the song was called, but it was the one where you can you can like control one of those. Alright, I think this is gonna well. be my winning attempt. Oh man, maybe we should try to pause on the long what run. What the hell? I couldn't even. You can't deploy it. Oh wait, I was pressing the drift button. Oh. My item. Ah, I'm so panicked right now because I haven't gotten this far and I can't save state. It would literally screw me over to try to save state, I believe. Yeah, I know because then you would lose momentum. I think though, okay, if Luigi gets first, that won't be the end of the world because Donkey Kong is the one who's more dangerous to me right now. Yeah, you do have that sometimes. Well, you can be lucky because of the one that that is actually supposed to be better than you had uh, bad luck as well. Oh man, this is the moment. Yay, I did it! Yes! See, Ashley, you did it without cheating. Look at that. You, you, can, you can now call yourself an MLG Pro Super Circuit okay. player. I'm going to say this is the last episode. I am never going to do 150cc. Fuck that. Oh, well, you've showed off the game, basically. Yeah, I've proven it is awful and no one should ever play it. I think this was a successful and the only finished Let's Play you have ever made so far. Hey, you got rank D, you should go for an A rank. Yes, of course. Okay, the credits. I don't know what to talk about in the credits other than this game is a fucking piece of shit. Like, my god, what were they thinking? What were they smoking when they made this game? 
Did no one test this and go, you know what? This is horrible. Look at this you scene. <laughs> this cutscene makes the game look like it's fun or something. <laughs> wow. You can go far, but that's, that's borderline. That's borderline. I don't even know, man. That was rude. Why did I mean, Luigi make all the characters in this game? And Yoshi. Why did Yoshi make this game? Uh, Yoshi made this game because he didn't have anything else to do. I like how they all have a Mario ish icon. It's all because of Princess Peach that I was able to do this. I'd like to thank the Academy. And I'd like to thank Peach. Okay, you know what's stupid? When someone says, I'd like to thank, that's such a dumb statement. This is like saying, I'd like to thank, but I'm not going to thank them. Yeah, that's true. That's a very legit statement you make there. So, I would like to think, but I'm not going to, so never mind. I would like to like this game, but I for don't. some reason I can't. Wonder I like why. I like how the credits is Cheese Land. <laughs> we all know that's the only stage worth anything. And again, I have to say that this is the best color palette for any stage ever. Yep. I do have to say that the Lego blocks are always nice to see. I wonder how much time it takes to put them in place. Look at Mouse. Or Mouser or whatever the hell they're called. Are they called Mousers? I think so. Oh. This reminds me of an episode of Tom and Jerry Cheese Land where Jerry gets lost on the moon and the moon's made of cheese. I don't know if they have Tom and Jerry in Belgium or if you've ever seen it. They did. They did. It, was, it wasn't voice, but I don't think there was a lot of voice acting in it anyway. No, there's no voice acting. Uh, yeah, Tom, Tom and Jerry almost never talk. I think the mom talked, or whatever you want to call her, the lady. That stereotypical black woman? Yes. Wasn't she always in the kitchen as well? Yeah, you never saw her, the upper portion of her body. Yeah, they do the same thing in the Powerpuff Girls with uh, that one lady. You know the one I'm talking about, the, the the one with the ginger hair and stuff. Yeah. So yeah, special thanks to all these people that have made the game so I much better. I hate you all. Why do we need to know the original? Oh. I thought this was gonna like tell us the people who made the original Super Mario Brothers. And I was like, what do I need to know? You know, at least now you can look up these people and send them hate mail. Yeah. <laughs> but don't refer to Super Circuit. Just say, dude, your Mario Kart game sucks. And then they would be like, oh, but Mario Kart 8 was okay, man. And then you would be like, yeah, but I mean, you have to atone for your sins. Game developed by... Fuck you, Intelligent Systems. No wonder this game sucks. <laughs> well, Intelligent Systems is a bad one. Wait, they had to have... They had to mention a specific company that made the 3D Donkey Kong model? What? Why was that necessary? Special thanks to whatever the name of the company was for supplying us with the 3D Donkey Kong model? <laughs> Without them, we couldn't make this game ever. Hey look, Nintendo, you would almost forget they were part of this. How much time do I need to read this? Read what? Oh, it wanted me to press a button. Oh, look guys, th this is it. Alright, so, in the next, I'm never playing this game again. I should just uninstall the ROM. Well, just delete it and go buy an actual copy so I can smash it with a hammer. Yeah, All and right. become famous. So, maybe next time I'll continue Pokemon Crystal. Probably not. I will watch it. That's why I'm subscribed. See ya. All right. Bye.